Press the green power button to turn on your instrument. You can see that we're in the milliohm and voltage range. We now can make a measurement by connecting the probes to the battery. Press one probe in, get a good connection, press the second probe. The instrument will beep and let you know that the measurement has started and that it is valid. An integrated save button allows you to save measurement data directly to the probe before moving on to your next test. You can see on the screen that you've successfully saved your measurement. Right now the instrument is in meter mode. Let's go to sequence mode by pressing the meter sequence button. Sequence mode allows you to take and store multiple measurements simultaneously. We've created a sequence name for this site, which is Fluke Park. Our device name is UPS. For the purpose of this demonstration, we'll assume we have 32 batteries in this string, supplying power to the UPS. Press the Continue button. You'll see that the first face in the memory is ready. As we connect the two probes, the instrument buzzes to confirm that it started the measurement and that the measurement is valid. Each time we remove the probe and make a new connection, the instrument automatically starts a new measurement. Each time you press the Save button on the probe, that measurement gets added to the sequence. Once we have all of our values in the memory, we can download them and create reports with the included battery analysis software. Check out fluke.com for more information.